Welcome to today's vlog. I'm Gary Wiryawan and as you can see, this is not Indonesia. I'm traveling and right now I'm in New Zealand with my wife and my friend as well. So we're gonna stay here in Queenstown for a few nights. We just arrived here, we just flew from Indonesia. We transited through Sydney and we're now here in Queenstown. So this is our first day. Today we're not going to do much of photography, uh, but we're just gonna uh, eat some dinner and then we're gonna start to do a little bit of sightseeing tomorrow. So stay tuned for tomorrow. Good morning, so this is our second day of our New Zealand trip. Yesterday we only eat dinner and then we just went to to rest because we were just so tired with our red eye flight and now it's time for finally some sightseeing and before we start our day uh, in this morning I just want to explore our Airbnb view which is very magnificent right here this is Lake Wakatipu in its full glory it's a little bit cloudy this morning but I want to try to make use of the moody kind of situation right here and turn it into a photograph so let's start to try to find some composition right now all right for our first composition this morning i just want to try to uh, kind of capture that trees over there with lake wakatipu as the midground and the mountain behind as sort of the background and just try to capture a very simple composition right now i'm using the panasonic g85 with the Panasonic Leica A to 18mm f2.8 to f4. I'm at full manual. I want to take a full control of all of the settings today so that I can really pinpoint any kind of exposure changes easily. So yeah, I'm at f4, I'm at 50 shutter speed and then I'm at ISO 200. I'm at 18mm right now, auto white balance. So let's try to just isolate those trees right there on the middle and try to... Uh, kind of get situated from there all right so yeah i'm going to focus on the tree and i'm going to raise the camera a little bit i don't want the building below there i just want the trees the lake and the mountain let's try to do that i think i need to lower my shutter speed a little bit but we'll see from the histogram right now the histogram is clipping a little bit that must be the sky clipping but i don't really care i can still recover a little bit of highlight if i need to because i'm shooting raw so yeah something like this very simple let's try to capture it one more time nothing too complicated all right and I potentially found something again. Now I switch a little bit to the left side of the Lake Wakatipu to the Frankton city area right there with the mountain behind right there. I want to try to capture a little bit of these greeneries with some of the buildings right there. I think it's very beautiful. I want to uh, try to capture the sun rising as well on the uh, sky right there. Let's try to capture it. I am still on the same setting, F450 shutter speed, ISO 218 millimeter. Let's try to isolate uh, the scenery right there. Something like this. Maybe I want to try to not include the cars below, uh, just the... Uh, just the trees and the uh, lake and also the mountain as a background something like this very simple composition nothing too fancy let's try to raise our shutter speed a little bit because I think from the histogram it is clipping right now we'll try to use about 100 shutter speed let's see how it turns out All right not so bad not so bad I think this looks nice. All right. All right, now I switch over to the right side of Lake Wakatipu. And right now I wanna play around using my telephoto lens. So I switch to the Panasonic GX85 with the 35 to 100 millimeter lens. And this is just such a fantastic little telephoto lens, especially for travel. So let's try to compose something right there. I wanna try to capture that intersection right there uh, with the lake and then also a part of the island right there and also the mountain behind and I will also try to include some of the greeneries on the foreground as sort of a uh, foreground of interest let's try to capture the image right now I'm at 35 millimeter let's see how it turns out yep it looks nice I want to try to zoom in a little bit closer I'm gonna switch to f5.6 and 50 shutter speed ISO 200 let's try maybe 70 let's try 70 millimeter maybe something like this i'm gonna try to raise no i don't want to raise the ISO. i want to lower 
the shutter speed i don't really care if the shutter speed is low because this camera has an excellent in body stabilizer so yeah i'm kind of focused at the houses right there maybe no maybe i want to try to use this oh yeah i found a nice foreground right here those trees right there as you can see so yeah maybe something like this i want to zoom out a little bit and yeah try to use it as sort of a foreground of interest and i get a little bit of the sky maybe a little bit more zoom out i'm at 50 millimeter right now let's try well wow, yeah look nice wow beautiful all right let's try it one more time it's really nice i'm zooming out again to about maybe 40 millimeter or so let's try to yep really nice zoom in just a little bit to 50 again so i think it looks nice Excellent, excellent. All right, so now we're here at the Lake Esplanade. We're finding this nice vantage point where I can try to photograph Lake Wakatipu with the different kinds of foreground of interest and also a very nice view right here it's just so wonderful and i'm already situated right here with my camera i have my panasonic g85 right now over there as you can see and i have it on a tripod right now so i'm going to do a long exposure i already have an andy filter right here this is a 10 stop andy filter and wow the the sun is just really nice the lighting is just really nice right now i want to try to photograph this kind of rock over here with the water from the lake coming in with the slow shutter speed it will be blurry and nice and smooth with the mountain as a background now let's try to capture the image oh the light is changing really fast so we have to be quick let's try to capture it So we are currently in the TSS Ernslow steamboat ship and we're going to have a little bit of a sightseeing tour around Lake Wakatipu. I think this is really a nice way to relax after a brunch that we just did. Alright, so I thought I found a nice composition while still riding the TSS Ernslow steamboat. Uh, we're currently on the way back to Queenstown and I saw this kind of mountain area with a little bit of towns, a little bit of greeneries and a little bit of clouds right there i just want to capture that scenery using a telephoto lens to get that compression effect so i got my panasonic gx85 with a 35 to 100 millimeter aperture priority i'm going to zoom to about maybe a hundred let's try or maybe about 70 and try to get a vertical composition uh, just a very simple composition involving a little bit of that uh, building area with the clouds and the mountain peak peeking out from the cloud i think it looks really nice i think with the lighting it also looks really nice so something like this very simple vertical composition let's try horizontal still at 70 millimeter i much prefer the vertical one because i think it's more dramatic in my opinion it helps to differentiate between the foreground mid ground and background and yep something very simple something very easy not too difficult i like this sort of composition and also that part over there similar story just different side so let's try to capture that one as well nice i like the mountain peaks picking up from the clouds looks really nice all right Alright, so we just finished strolling around the town of Queenstown and right now we're gonna head to the Skyline Gondola and we're gonna have dinner right there and maybe photograph the town of Queenstown from above and also play a little bit of the uh, uh, lodge or whatever you call it, that uh, thing right there. And yeah, this has been a really nice day. I've been able to photograph many things today and also discover a lot of things in Queenstown. So yeah, I'll see you on the Skyline. All right, so I'm at the gondola skyline. We already ride the uh, gondola from below. Now we're at the uh, summit of the hill and now I'm 
at the few point where I can photograph the town of Queenstown right there as you can see so beautiful from up here this is still in the afternoon so the lighting is not the most perfect but at least it is sunny and clear and I want to photograph it with my wide angle lens so this is my G85 with the 8 to 18 millimeter f2.8 to f4 I'm at aperture priority f5.6 keeping everything else automatic very simple composition this is a very iconic place to photograph the town of Queenstown with a wide angle lens and sort of using the uh, hill right there as sort of the foreground and the mountain behind there as sort of the background with the sky as well very nice very nice I'm waiting for the gondola to pass by nice all right So we just finished playing lunch right now and we're gonna head for dinner in Skyline Gondola and I think I wanna end the vlog right here. So that is all for today's New Zealand adventure. I hope that you enjoyed this video and please stay tuned for the next video. Also don't forget to support my channel by liking this video, sharing this video and subscribing to my channel. Thank you and see you on the next vlog.